um, regards. My name is Daria, and I will get to the point. So in terms of logistics, uh, when we talk about Atlantic trade, we are covering the Croatia area through one central DC, one regional DC, and two cross-dock centers. Uh, we're talking of rather huge numbers for us. So as you can see, there are over uh, 30,000 documents going through our warehouse uh, monthly. There is over 20,000 deliveries. We use uh, both external and internal trucks. Um, somewhere around 30% of the vehicles are own, and the rest is external. Uh, over 11,000 pallets delivered monthly to the region. Okay, sorry. So I will get to the point and try to uh, go through the process as is. So we will follow three steps, three easy steps of the case. Uh, so first one is order, getting the order into our system, into our main uh, system SAP. So after we receive the order, uh, the order goes to our transport management system where uh, we are doing the routing of that order. Each order gets the planning route, gets the truck, uh, an ID number. After that, of course, warehouse process. So each order has to be picked and prepared for the delivery point. Um, and in that moment, dispatch notes are printed. There are lots of paperwork. So uh, the dispatch notes per delivery, there are two, uh, two delivery notes and three truck loading lists for each driver. Uh, the goods is done physically, uh, controlled physically at the onboard of the warehouse. And uh, after the truck is loaded, uh, the documents are signed by the warehouse and by the driver. Uh, so the second thing is dispatching the, the delivery or the order. Uh, so it's done on the field. Uh, the driver goes to the location. Uh, goods are unloaded and, of course, physically checked by the cons uh, customer and by the driver. And after that, dispatch notes are signed, and if there is any correction of the dispatch note, it has to be signed and corrected physically on the paper. Okay. And the third uh, step is post-delivery. So uh, when the truck is arrived back to the warehouse, in some cases, the driver just gets the papers to our administration, but if there are any differences on the delivery note, he has to do all the process again. So he has to check physically what the driver returned, they have to sign another paper, and after that, uh, process can be finished uh, in whole through our system, uh, and the whole track documentation is checked three times, uh, so there is one additional dispatch note copy for administration, they can put in uh, archive, of, of course, also uh, physically. Okay, so what is wrong with this process? I would say uh, lots of things. <laughs> so I will describe challenges that we have now, again, from the beginning. So in the first process, when you see the, this graph, uh, what we tried to em emphasize is that uh, everything after the order is placed uh, from the customer, uh, he's completely visible uh, where is his order uh, and the status of that order. So. Uh, until the truck is until the truck is camped to the to the delivery point, there is nothing much he can see. So this is the step that shows that Atlantic or logistics is uh, blind when the truck leaves our warehouse. Uh, so everything that is going on on the sailing point, so where the driver is, if he's having some problems on the route to the uh, to the delivery point, is something that we are still digging up and using only mobile phones and calls to, uh, to try to connect to him. And the third part, so as you can see, when the driver is coming back, there's nothing the customer can see about his order when it's finished. And uh, um, everything here is, um, I, I would say, nothing here is visible to, to customer. So there are we have warehouse management system, we have transport management system, we have the main ERP, and all the data is inside of those systems, but we can't co collect them in a, one easy way that we can track our status, st each status of, uh, of each orders without using cell phones. And um, 
what could be better? So it's 2017 and our driver is still having pen and bunch of papers. Uh, we have limited communication with the driver. As I said, um, around 70% of the external drivers uh, are using only their mobile phones. Um, our trucks are equipped with the GPS tra tracking, but it's still uh, not enough information. So we're lacking a delivery return information. We are lacking information about some reclamation logs and tracking, uh, and also there is no transparency of the delivery process. So um, this, um, our case, uh, headed this direction to get all the information. So of course, my main goal is to have higher productivity in the dispatching center because today it's like a, like CS, watching CSI. When you get the phone call from an angry customer, there is uh, about two to three hours work to discover where the thing go, uh, went wrong from the order to the uh, to the delivery. So uh, my colleague Jakob will describe a model that we placed as a situation to be. Thank you. <laughs> 